With the impending climate and biodiversity catastrophe, we simply cannot wait any longer to restore the delicate balance within the natural world. Nature needs to be at the center of our economic model. It has become apparent that it is not a lack of capital that is holding us back, but rather the way we deploy it. Building a sustainable future is in fact the growth story of our time. If we are to drive global economic growth, it is imperative that we value and invest in our natural capital. The current health, climate and biodiversity crisis are different consequences of an economic system addicted to fossil resources and growth at all costs. A system that fails to value our most important capital, nature. The Circular Bioeconomy Alliance will help preserve biodiversity by connecting investors with investable solutions to the global climate crisis. All that while creating sustainable well-being. There is no future for business as usual. We have the knowledge to build a new economy, an economy that prospers in harmony with nature, powered by nature. This is why this needs to happen, and happen now. The investment industry represents approximately $120 trillion of capital, and its primary objective is always going to be about returns. What has changed today is that some of the most Compelling investment opportunities lie in the transition to a more sustainable economic framework. One that puts climate transition and nature at the center stage. What we have found is that companies whose business models are aligned with the concept of harnessing nature or preserving nature, not only can deliver today better profitability, but have also much better growth opportunities for the future. I think we are at a very interesting inflection point. If we are able to create scalable investment opportunities, we will attract mainstream capital to the transition to a sustainable economy. And this is why, inspired by His Royal Highness, the Prince of Wales, Lombardier, is now in a position to launch a natural capital investment strategy in public markets. This is why I am enormously encouraged, if I may say so, to see that as part of my Sustainable Markets initiative, the Circular Bioeconomy Alliance is working hand in hand to support the natural capital strategy developed by Lombard Odier. As we look to innovate and accelerate, it is time for leaders to step forward and demonstrate what is possible so that others can follow. <laughs>